Hey, this is Ralph at Flex Film, and today we have our heat lamp demonstration, and we're going to have a little fun today. Um, going to be kind of casual about this. I'm sitting on my orange bucket. Uh, we got some slides in here. Each one represents something I want to show you. But, you know, at Flex Film, you know, we don't make film. We have to find products that we sell, and we've had a lot of luck with the ones we sell now. We've made some mistakes before, but, you know, right now, uh, we're not changing anything. We, we got a good lineup and that's the, what we're going with. But I just want to share something with you because this, this little heat box has really helped me out a lot. And if, you know, if something helps me, why can't it help you? That, that's my theory here. You know, a lot of times we want to overcomplicate, you know, things and, you know, we want to look at specs and, you know, yeah, we can go down that road, okay? But for this video, we're going to have some fun because this is just a simple box. This is a bulb that I, that I bought at Home Depot and it's a 250 watt you know, heat bulb. And you can press a button and you can turn it on and you can, you know, you can feel the heat off of it. It's, it's pretty simple. And because I wish you could reach your hand out and, and put it right here in front of this box, you know, but you can't do that. So that's why I've got a heat sheet. This, this, seat, this sheet is, is sensitive to, uh, to heat. It's the closest possible thing I could come up with that would represent you know, what you could actually feel with your hand. And, and we're gonna do it with an image. And let me show you what I'm talking about. We're gonna turn it on, focus on the heat sheet. Just watch what it does, you know, with this powerful heat bulb here. Okay, it turns colors in the presence of heat. It's pretty simple. I turn it off, then it starts to kind of go back down to, 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 the, to the black color. Okay, why am I making this video? Because there's a lot of window films out there for us to choose. You too, of course. And you know, which one is the one we should choose? Which one's the best choice? And that gets very complicated. But, but let's talk about performance. I mean, if, you, if you're looking for a ceramic window film or an IR window film and you want something that's really gonna outdo the guy down the street and you wanna have the best and you, know, you, you wanna certainly preserve your reputation and uh, you know, get as much business as you possibly can, get as much credibility, okay, where do you go to buy the best film and you know, what's gonna be the best performance or the value? Well, let me show you something that I want you to be aware of, okay? I'm gonna call a lot of you guys out, okay? Cause I'm guilty of this. If I can be guilty of it, then you can be guilty of it. You see, for over 20 years of my career, I've been, I've been in this 30 years, okay? But for over 20 years, I was, I was flying blind, okay? I, I was being told that window films block out heat. I was telling my customers they block out heat. You know, we're putting them on cars. And uh, that wasn't always true. And, and, and what, what really, really shocked me was when I had a window film film rep came by to visit me and showed me some technology from a really popular company uh, with some of the newer IR technologies that are out there to this very day. And when I put my hand in front of that heat lamp demonstration and he showed me that product, I was impressed. But I wasn't really impressed as much as you would think I was because I'm like, hey, all the other films I got here probably did the same thing. And he said, well, go back there and get those films and let's see what you've got. I said, okay. So I went back and started getting my favorite films, the ones I've been putting on for years. We, we, we built these glass slides and we you know, began to put them in front of the heat lamp. I was, I was more shocked than how much the first film he showed me would, would work because everything I put my hand in front of wouldn't work. Well, let me show you an example of what I'm talking about. This is a dyed film, okay? This, is, this has got a lifetime warranty. This comes from a fancy big name company. And you know, we're not gonna go around selling dyed, I mean, dyed limousine to, to everybody, but for this example, let me show you how intrigued I was about this. And I'm gonna drop it down in, in, in front of this uh, powerful bulb and I'm gonna put the heat sheet here and I wanna pr press the button and let's just watch what happens. That, it doesn't take long for you to see. There's, there's heat barreling out of this. It's, I mean, it's like, what? This is, this is limousine tent, it's not even stopping anything. Okay, if that doesn't shock you like it did me, let me shock you a little bit more. Um, here's a film right here that I want to point out. Now, now this company is a, a newer company. I don't know, I don't say a new company. It's been out for, let's just say 10 years or, 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 or less. Um, that's not the point. The point is that this is a big name. Big name company, uh, they, they're beginning to market and sell their, their ceramic uh, products. And uh, if you want to buy a roll of this stuff right here, you're gonna probably pay, and I'm gonna be vague about this because I don't want to try to identify the company. You're gonna pay you know, well over $2 a square foot. I mean, that, that, that translates to you know, $1,200 or more dollars per roll. That's a 60 by 100, okay? So, so, so they're selling this stuff. Now, now look, this, this film's beautiful. 
Uh, if you installed this film on something, you, you would probably be very happy. Uh, it would match factory tent, the hard coat's really great. Uh, even the adhesives, I mean, respectable. You know, it just hadn't been out long enough. We don't know how, how long it's gonna last or what it's gonna do, but you know, if you, if you bought this film and you pay $1,200, you're probably going to be happy, you know, from, from your experience with it because it really is a, is a pleasurable product to install. But if you're guilty of not checking your window films and doing your homework, I mean, if you got a little extra money and you can buy an IR meter, a broad spectrum IR meter, you can really get to the bottom of what this film can and can't do and, and know what you're dealing with. But most people can't afford that or don't want to buy that. So, you know, what, what else can you do? Well, you can always trust your hand. I mean, anytime we put our hand in front of a, a, an infrared radiation source or even a heat source, and, and we simply put our window film in front of it, you, you're gonna know if it's gonna work or not. It's not very scientific, but you know, if this film's designed to absorb that, the, the energy, which is what automotive films do, then, then all the energy is gonna stop right here at the glass, and when you put your hand here, you're not gonna feel it. Or if it lets a little bit through, you're gonna feel a little bit. Or if it lets a lot through, you're gonna feel a lot. But anyway, I just want to point out, this is an extreme example that there's a company out there that's selling a ceramic window film. They're boasting about how wonderful it is. They're, 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 they're getting a premium price for it. And people are buying it because they're not checking themselves. They're not doing their homework. They're not putting their hands in front of it. And, and I just want to make sure you guys don't fall into the trap. I mean, if you're really trying to give your customers maximum performance, you know, this is what could happen to you. Now I'm going to turn it on and let's watch the heat sheet. See, it is respectable, it's not bad. But see, bam, there it goes. I mean, so what does this mean? What, is this, what can I tell you with my words? If you put your hand here, you're gonna feel heat, but you're, it's, gonna be, it's gonna be respectable. I'm not gonna say it's not, but, but, it, but it's actually gonna, um, you know, it's there. And, it, you know, but I, if you're trying to buy a window film with this level of performance, there's a lot of great choices out there for a dollar a square foot instead of over $2 a square foot that have respectable names. I mean, this film, somebody's trying to get twice as much money as what it's worth or more because of the name that's associated with it. And people are buying it because they don't do their homework. And, and if they're looking for performance, they're getting the short end of the stick. If they're looking for a brand, maybe they're not getting the short end of the stick. I, I, I report you decide. I'm just creating awareness. I'm not trying to bash anybody. That's why I'm not using their name. But I will say that if somebody, you know, really was uh, performance oriented, you know, there are products out there, well, there's not many products like this one. This is one that, that we're selling. I'm not going to tell you really what it is. I'm not going to make this a sales video. This is the best thing we've got. This is the best thing that we found that we market in, in, in our company. And, um, you know, if, if you want to pay, you know, a similar price and, you know, you want to see what's out there, this is what, what we found, okay? If you can find something better, you know, please let me know. I'm always interested in hearing about good films. Um, I want to show you what this will do. Now, now before I, I push this button, i got to tell you something that's kind of cool. This film is so powerful and it absorbs so much energy. We kind of play with it sometimes because it'll crack glass, okay? Now, it won't crack, crack glass on a car. Car glass is usually tempered and it's very strong and it's, it's, it's resilient, you know, it's made for heat. But, you know, you're talking about a piece of quarter inch plate glass, double strength plate glass. Okay, this stuff, if I put it in your house, it wouldn't even be up to most codes. If I put it in your car, it, it wouldn't, it just doesn't go, to go in cars because if it breaks, it, it shatters. Uh, this is really weak glass, even though it's thick and we can kind of bang it around a little bit. You know, it's good for slide presentations, but it's very poor quality for, you know, putting in our home or, um, you know, our car, of course. But I wanna show you what it does. It just, this is a performance video. There, there's some other products out there in this category that are a lot, lot better priced that you know, you really get a lot of bang for your buck that have no dye in them, but watch what it does. Again, uh, I'm just gonna sit here and leave it on. I don't know how long it's gonna take, but it doesn't take long to bust the glass. I want you guys to watch this. This, this glass is, I mean, I don't wanna put my hand and interfere with it, but we're, we can sit here for quite a while. You can see if there's any, any energy or any heat, it's gonna pick it up right here. This film's really quite amazing on, I mean, what it's gonna block out, what it's gonna absorb. But uh, th th I just don't know of anything else in the industry right now that's, that's better than this. I've got some films that are giving it a run for its money, but for, for, a, for an absorbing technology, I mean, this, this, this is incredible. I mean, all this energy is coming into this glass and it's, it's soaking it up like a sponge. This glass is getting physically hotter. 
and hotter and hotter. It's building up. And at some point, you know, it, it'll, just, it'll just crack. Now, on your car, it won't crack. Pl trust me on this. This is why we don't put this film on flat glass applications. This is why we probably wouldn't put this film on like maybe a sunroof because it's getting direct sunlight. But um, I don't know. I wish we had a timer here. Maybe uh, we should have a timer. Maybe we'll edit that in on the video and uh, we'll see how many seconds it takes. But um, again, look at that, folks. There's no, I mean, we can sit here and talk it and talk it and talk it. It's going to take a long time, if, if ever, for there to get any, any heat to touch this heat sheet. I mean, this, this is, I, I can't, I wish I could put my hand in front. I wish I could put your hand in front of this, man. Uh, this film right here, it, you know, it, it, all the shades that we have uh, have this level of performance. And when you put them on a car, you, you know, you can, uh, you, you, can, you can just feel the difference. That's all I'm trying to tell you. It may not have a fancy brand attached to it uh, that, that you know, is recognizable that anybody else is selling in the industry, but when it comes in a flex zone box, I can tell you, you, you know, when you buy it, this is, this is what you can expect. You can take your heat lamp demonstration, uh, you can put it on there. Uh, it's just, I don't, I don't even know if we got enough, how much memory do we have on this card here? You know, I was hoping the, the, the glass would bust by now, but sometimes we, we get some glass that's just better than others. But, um, I mean, I don't know, any, oh, oh, here, here we go. How long has it been, man? Is it, uh, what's it gonna do? I mean, it's, uh, how long, I, oh, there it goes, folks. Look at that, bam. Look at that. I mean, I, 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 I wish I could measure the thermometer how hot this is. I can, I could burn my face with this, man. This is crazy. This, this film, I'm, I'm just telling you, if you want the best, you got to get this, man, okay? If you want to know what some of these other films are and you want to call me and have a personal conversation, I'll be glad to have a professional, personal conversation with you. But uh, I'll even tell you about some of the other testing that we're doing and what we're finding. Uh, there's a lot of films out there that are impressive, okay? But there's some out there that, it's a joke, man. I don't, I don't understand how they're getting away with it. But, you know, th this is the real deal, folks. I bust any glass, you know, if, you know, if it's plate <laughs> with this demonstration. Bring it on, man. But, uh, hey, thanks for watching. I just wanted to create some awareness about, you know, not all ceramic window films are created equal. They block out different levels of, um, of, of uh, heat and solar energy. And uh, sometimes you just got to trust your old hand, you know, to know, know what you're really getting, if you're, especially if you're on a budget and you just want to know real quick. But um, thank you. Thank you for watching. And I uh, hope this was entertaining for you, like it was for me. Thank you.